what's up everybody Matt Austin here and today oh hell yeah it's another town hall it's a town hall yeah fry sure in my town yeah oh hell yeah uh today I got a ton of stuff a lot of figures so it's figure palooza oh hell yeah uh, I got a ton of them from all kinds of genres, whatever you want to say, horror, wrestling, all that good stuff. I got scissors. No, I couldn't find my box cutter, couldn't find my little knife. Uh, I got some cheats today, guys. What? Straight from eBay. Uh, stuff I've always wanted. Stuff been on my bucket list. So I went ahead, pulled the trigger. I say we get into it. Uh, all right, here's the eBay stuff. This one's from Indiana. Something I've been wanting for a long time. Let's get into it. Y'all know how it goes with me and trying to open stuff. It's usually a hassle. Got there we go. Let's see what we got. Got two small things and one big thing. Anyways, oh hell yeah. We know what this is. Or I do. Something I've been wanting for a while. This looks like it's gonna be in pretty good condition. And there we go. It's Friday the 13th, original NES game. Uh, man, this is in pretty damn good condition. Check that out. This was $19 on eBay. Back's a little scuffed up, but the front looks good. That's all that really matters. The top looks good. Oh my God, look at that. Going right back there with the NES thing. And uh, man, you love to see it. I remember I used to rent this all the time, and I don't think I ever got <laughs> probably 10 minutes in. I always got my ass kicked. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I wasn't very good at it. What year was that? 1988. So I probably played around 92, I imagine. It's probably when I was renting it, but got some bubble wrap. Oh, hell yeah. All right, next up, got another smaller one. Uh, this one is from Massachusetts. Oh, hell yeah. I've been up there a few times. Five minutes later. Here we go. I didn't get the one with the hat, uh, but hell, I'll be happy with this. 15 bucks. I got the Undertaker Bone Crunchers. Oh, in the dark one. Oh, hell yeah. I know he's a little scuffed up. That's fine with me. He's just a placeholder. Kind of want a mint on card one of these, but man, this is one I had when I was a kid that, of course, got thrown away by my piece of trash mom's ex boyfriend. Threw all our stuff away. Yeah, he's just badass. We'll, we'll uh, light him up a little bit. I I'm sure he glows. He's already glowing right there. There we go. Badass. Bone Crunchers Undertaker going back there. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. He, he just looks cool. I, I wish I would have got the hat with him, but it was kind of a kind of a drunk purchase actually. <laughs> but it's one I had on my bucket list. And the last cheat of the day from Florida. This one's 38 bucks. Something I've been wanting for a while. I had like a few of them, and I thought about getting it from China. But uh, I went ahead and got one from America. I'm sure they got it from China and probably up the price. That's what a lot of people do. But anyways, you know, I said before, Return of the Living Dead is my favorite horror movie. Uh, it is, but also I have another favorite. I have probably two or three favorites. <laughs> it's hard to choose. But uh, this is definitely one that stuck with me. And we'll see what the condition's like. Actually, pretty damn... Good. Yay! So we're happy so far. <laughs> but Nightmare on Elm Street 3 Dream Warriors. Freddy Necka figure. Oh my god. That is something I've wanted since first time I saw it. Love Dream Warriors. Best Nightmare on Elm Street. Even better than the original. You're crazy. Oh my god. This is very happy with this quality. He's getting a good rating on this one. Damn, not a scuff on it. Anyways, there we go. Check him out. Freddy Krueger. Oh my god. Comes with the little puppet. He's got extra hat, extra head, yelling, extra glove. He's got the syringe fingers. Jesus Christ. He's got the little dollhouse. 
I mean, this thing is badass. Always wanted this. Uh, never saw it in stores, so I said, I guess we're going eBay. 38 bucks. I'll pay that all day for this. This looks good. There we go. Going right back up there. As you can see, I got the neck is going across, and I'll have like, you know, the kind of other kind of horror figures. And I got the Funkos. I'm gonna go all the way around. I got a good plan for it. We'll 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 see. But oh hell yeah! All right, let's go. Gotta go Walmart next. Woo! Oh hell yeah! Bought a man. Let's <laughs> wait till you see what all I got at Walmart. It's crazy. You ain't gotta wait too long. We'll start off small. Uh, this series I always like, and there's a few of them I haven't seen actually. And uh, it's eight film collection. Of all the Saw movies, oh, hey. oh hell yeah, uh, kind of broke away from the figure, I was going to try to do a lot of figures, but I saw the Jason game, I had to get that, and you'll see a few other stuff, yeah, I've never seen Jigsaw, and I don't think I've, uh, I don't think I've seen Saw 5 before, Gosh. so, oh wait, Saw 6 in the final chapter, and then Jigsaw, Jigsaw's rated R, so hopefully there's not unrated version but I've never seen it so we'll check it out but there we go all the Saw movies oh hell yeah and I will get you the price real quick so $9.96 and you get the whole collection hell yeah and I haven't seen Spiral yet either I gotta check out Spiral there we go all right next up let's switch it up a little bit from horror got some AEW figures Yay! oh yeah, you, know, you know I love it Get the receipt. We got Luchasaurus. Oh you, my bitch. god. It's the man himself. Love me some Luchasaurus. Had to get it. And uh already had the unrivaled series five hangman page back there. So we had to get Lucha. There he is. Badass. That's from Double or Nothing. 2019 Las Vegas. Oh hell yeah. He looks cool as hell. He's just as as T -t -t Today, Junior! <laughs> ass kicking Don. I almost said ass kissing. Ass kicking Don Store. What? Sore. God I cannot talk. 1987 on that one. So there we go. Alright, next up, another AEW figure. I'm surprised to tell how I got this one because our town is. Thank giving AEW too much love. I'll just say that. But every once in a while, get in there. I know there's a guy at Walmart that's actually collecting these two he follows me around he checks out everything i do he's a piece of trash hey, fuck you, buddy. i got this one bomb it's funny because uh this one was actually further down the road behind some jurassic park figures hey, what? and uh i can tell somebody's hiding it i know it's him he's a piece of trash but uh here we go darby allen series one unmatched oh my god look at that cool as hell this is from Full Gear, Jacksonville, 2020. And man, he's got the TNT title. He's got skateboard. And he's just painted up cool. Look at that. There's that Dustin I wanted to get. I should have got it. You Damn it, because I never saw it again. There we go, Darby Allen. Oh, hell yeah. Badass. Of course, 1987 again, too. So, there we go. Great year, 87. I barely remember it. All right, next up, Woo. go back to horror for a second. Coming in at $29.96. This is badass, in great condition. We got the Scream Ultimate Ghost Face <laughs> figure. Oh, hell yeah, check that out. Oh my God. This is, I mean, he's got the sickle, he's even got the voice changer, all his little knives. He's got a glow-in-the-dark mask, he's got a few different masks. He's got the bloody mask, kind of crusty old mask. Man, this thing is beautiful, I love it. And uh, it doesn't say scream anywhere on it, so what? I'm starting to think Ghostface is like its own entity, entity, whatever, now. Like doing his own thing, I'm not sure. But uh, then I saw a Scream shirt, but it had Ghostface on it. It had Casey from the first movie. Wow. So maybe Scream and Ghostface, like, broke off. I have no clue. But anyways, it's badass. There it is. 
Ghostface, oh hell yeah. Going up with the NECA figures. Man, I already got Freddy Ghostface, and I got more coming. You'll see. But, uh, anyways, got these yesterday. Definitely doing men on card uh, Funko Pops now. And I saw this is a Walmart exclusive. I had to get it. It's who I always play with. It's Scorpion. Get over Mortal here! Kombat. The movie. The new movie. Which I love. And man, I had to get old Scorpion. Uh, see, we got Cole from the movie. Sub-Zero. Definitely got to get Sub-Zero. And Sonya Blade. So I'll probably get Sub-Zero from that line. I don't know if they have older Mortal Kombat figures. Holy but I'll have to get in, uh, Check that out. No oh, hell yeah, he looks cool. He was a badass in the movie, loved it. No oh, hell yeah. Uh, Funko. 878 on that. Okay, we got uh, another one coming up. I said I gotta get Sub Zero. I got Sub Zero. Yay! <laughs> it, it's not the Funko Pop though. I'm not sure what this was. It's a Mortal Kombat classic Q fig. And, uh, yeah, I guess that's what it looks like. Um, screw it. We're going for it. We're opening up. Do it! The box is trash anyway, so let's see what we got. I got to check this bad boy out. He's going back there. It's all good. Box, eh, kind of trash. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, it's a lot. It's smaller than I thought it was. That's what she said. But damn, it's badass. I'm actually glad it's small because I'm running out room on the desk. Ooh, man. This is cool looking though. Look, check that out. It's so beautiful. Yeah. Oh my God. That is a thing of beauty right there. Got the little ice crystals. He's making a high fall. Man, I like that. There's a bottom. It says 95. Damn, how many they got? I'll take this one all day. He's definitely going back there. See, I put the Street Fighter figures back there. He might go right in the middle. Switch it up a little bit. He can go right there for now. Now let's stick Undertaker. Oh my God, that's beautiful. Love it. That was 1988. It's a little bit. <laughs> I kind of dig it. So there we go. Oh, well, mine now. So there we go. Five hours later. Coming in, $29.96, here we go. It's the Ultimate Stripe Gremlin NECA figure. What is that? Oh, hell yeah. This thing, they had a few Gremlin figures. They had Gizmo, but I had to start with this one because, good God almighty, he comes with a skateboard. He comes with a damn chainsaw. <laughs> oh, my God. That thing is cool as hell, guys. Check that out. Oh my god. This one's a lot thicker than the usual ones. I was tempted, I was kind of tempted to get him off card. I think he'd look cool back there with a chainsaw, but nah, he's going up on the wall. <laughs> and we did get a lot of figures, I'll tell you that. Now let's keep it going. I got one more. This will definitely be coming out of the package. I knew it when I bought it. Uh, 1688, 82, 1682, two guys I don't have back there, believe it or not, two of my favorites from the Attitude Era growing up, we got Stone Cold, we got Mankind, it's a championship yeah. showdown, oh yeah, yeah, oh my god, I saw this, I was like, oh, there, there we go, I was actually going to order Austin figure off eBay, and then I got this, I was like, oh, we're good, and then get Mankind too, two of my favorites, and it's badass. It comes with these little stands that also can go like into the title belts. I'll, I'll put them on the stands probably. But man, check that out. Those are definitely coming out. Doing the Undertaker. I might get a newer Undertaker figure, but I, I definitely had to get that Bone Crunchers. I had that one when I was a kid. But yeah, there we go. Badass. Love it. Look at this pile. Holy moly. And there we go. That is the Walmart haul. Oh, hell yeah. All right. Next up, books a million. Woo! Oh, hell yeah. Put these scissors up before I cut myself. You're stupid. Yeah, books a million. I, I went a little overboard there, but they had some cool stuff this week. Oh, last two weeks. I'll, I'll say these videos are more like two weeks than weekly. So, well, now. But, yeah, first off. 
I'm gonna get the receipt out. Here we go, coming at 629. I got them both somehow because there's a few Freddy's, but only one Jason. I'm happy. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, foam magnets. Freddy versus Jason foam magnets. Oh, I hey. think these are cool. So, <laughs> I'll find a spot for them back there somewhere. Oh, hell yeah. $6.29 a piece. My fingernails are dirty. I didn't even realize. <laughs> Sorry about that. But hell yeah. Pretty damn cool. Find a spot for them. You see, I got a lot of little trinkets up there. And uh, probably put those across the top. Looks kind of cool. Breaks it up a little bit. Uh, next up, twenty four twenty nine. I was debating on getting this. It's kind of kitty, but man, it's Michael Myers. I had to get it. It's a Michael Myers pillow. Oh, oh hell yeah. Uh, like I said, twenty four twenty nine. And man, look at that. It's pretty dang cool. I wish he had a knife with him, but it is what it is. Uh, I don't even know I got room for him back there for y'all to see, but. I'm gonna do my collection like along this wall, along that wall, and uh, show y'all when I can. I'll do a full tour eventually, but there we go. Got me a pillow. I'll never use it as a pillow, but it's comfortable. I mean, somebody might. There we go. This was on clearance, and it's something I've been wanting for a while. It goes along with the NECA figure from earlier. And the package is kind of dinged up, but I'm, I'm still gonna keep it mint on card. But, uh, just one second. Five minutes later. All right, there we go. Nightmare on Elm Street Part 3, Dream Warriors Freddy, clothes figure. This one he had the tuxedo. It says it comes with a light up Elm Street house replica. That's what I was just trying to do, get this clearance sticker off. Because, oh, hell yeah, they had a big clearance section. I couldn't believe this was in there. I've been uh, thinking about getting this for a while. I don't know if y'all can see it. It's got the, uh, the Elm Street house in there. But yeah, I want to start collecting these cloth, cloth, clothed, whatever figures. And uh, yeah, this sucks right here. Uh, I, I, I never really like these plastic, uh, whatever packages, but it is what it is. There's Freddy on the back. He's got his tongue out. He's a nasty mother. But anyways, and uh, yeah, this looks cool. If you remember him coming in with the tuxedo, it's creepy as hell. Yeah, another one from part three, best horror movie, one of the best horror movies ever in my opinion. Yep. And uh, yeah, couldn't believe I saw that on clearance, I had to get it. And uh, yeah. So next up, I'll just hold them both up. Come in uh, 15, 29 each. And I thought these were pretty cool. Go with the cloth figures. Oh hell yeah, we got Hannibal, we got Candyman. Damn. Woo, check it out. Oh hell yeah. There we go. Oh my god. Two legends of horror right there. And they uh they had a few more of these that I will be getting if they're still there. I might get them online. But uh yeah, those are pretty damn cool. Like uh let's see, Hannibal, he's got his little mask down there. Candyman, he's got his hook. Oh my god. Beautiful figures. Looks a lot like them. And 8 inch action figures, 14 points articulation. I'll be leaving them in the package, but there we go. Set them right there. Might as well set Freddy on the figure pile. I'll try to get a picture of all the figures together. <laughs> the thumbnail. Yeah, there we go. Books a million. Badass stuff. Love it all. Spent a lot of money, but I'm happy. And yeah, uh, last one. You know it was coming. FYE. Woo! Oh, hell yeah. And uh, I didn't go crazy at FYE, but I did finally get the uh, discount. Oh, yeah. Uh, to go with the, I got the leather face. I got Chucky. Now I got Freddy. Yay! Oh, hell yeah. Coming in at $8.99. And oh, yeah. This little uh, pop keychain. Love these little guys. I'll never use them as a keychain, but definitely. This is a collectible, I love them. And uh, yeah, it's badass. I got Freddy Magnus, man, I went Freddy crazy this time. Oh, hell yeah, one of my favorites. And uh, yeah, pretty badass. So there we go, got that. 
So that collection's growing. I'm probably gonna have to get a few off eBay because I can't find them here in town. And uh, yeah, I couldn't find many t-shirts at Walmart. I might have to start shopping elsewhere. It looks like the horror selection's pretty low right now. But uh, I, I did get one at FYE. And uh, it's pretty cool. It's a Good Guys Funko uh, box set, box collection. It's got the Good Guys logos. And uh, it's from Child's Play 2. And what it is, it's a Funko Pop, but it's also a t-shirt. So there we go. I actually found one, extra large, my size. I'm a big boy. And uh, how much was this? $26.99. Oh, hell yeah. And uh, apparently it's got the Funko Pop in the shirt in it. We gotta let that breathe. We got to. So bear with me. Five hours later. Oh, hell yeah. I got it open. Here we go. Let's check it out. Let's see what we got. Okay, this is what I was hoping for. That'd be Chucky. I'll figure this out. Let's do it. Chucky Men on Card. Funko Pop. And it's already double protected. There we go. Child's Play 2. <laughs> got the Chucky. Looks just like the back. He's got the Jack in the Box looking all scared. From the famous movie poster that I used to see at the video store all the time. Now I got the Funko Pop. That's cool as hell. Definitely going back there. That's going to be cool having the Funko Pops line up the top of the wall and the sides. And who knows where else. Depends on how far I want to go with that collection. But oh hell yeah. That's exactly how I was hoping it'd come out. And here we go. Oh this already looks cool. Hell yeah. Look at that bag up. It's kind of like the Funko version of Chucky. But I mean, it actually had some blood on it, which is pretty dang cool. Oh yeah, it's my size. It looks, it looks badass. Damn, I, I'm, I'm digging this. Sorry, Jack. Chucky's back. Oh hell yeah. Check it out. Oh my god. That's cool as hell. You get a Funko and you get a freaking brand new shirt. Smells brand new. <laughs> I don't know why I want it. There we go. If you haven't noticed, every new video I put out, I'm wearing the shirt from the last video, so go check those out. Reason to go back and check them out, I guess. But oh, hell yeah. That is cool as hell. I'm digging that. Got the blood splatter. Oh, hell yeah. Man. Very happy with this haul. Got some badass stuff. Stuff I've wanted for a while. And, uh, man. I mean, just look at this pile of figure. Well, I don't know if you can. But, uh... And I've, I've been buying scratchers like every day, so I, I'm not even going to do the scratcher thing. I, I win like 20 bucks, if that, every time. I haven't like hit anything big. And I always videotape it, but it ain't even worth showing. But anyways, there we go. Town Hall and a little bit of eBay Hall, but uh, badass stuff. Very happy. And next video, you'll see it back there. And uh, I got some more videos, because digging in storage, I found some really cool stuff. And we're going to see how much it's worth. And uh, hopefully it's up there. That was good. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Um, we're going to be doing town halls every week or two weeks. And uh, I'm going to try to throw some other videos in there too. Uh, some cool stuff coming. Yeah, we're just having a good time. I'm starting this collection. And man, I'm digging it. I'm finding all kinds of stuff. Stuff from my childhood. That's what it's all about. Yeah, let's just keep it going. But anyways, thanks for stopping by, and I'll catch you guys down the road. And that's the bottom line, because Matt Austin said so.